Highway Patrol has announced an arrest in a road rage shooting in Alameda County. It stems from a crime that happened back in September near the Caldecott Tunnel. Road rage and shootings along Bay Area freeways, of course, have been a big problem, uh, particularly recently. That says we're heading into a busy President's Day weekend. Cronforce Dan Thorne has the story. Exactly four months after bullets were fired into someone's car on Highway 24, the suspected gunman has been arrested. CHP officers say the crime was a result of road rage. 20-year-old Troy Nicholson Jr. of Castro Valley is now facing several charges. With the leads that we received from the public and with the technology at hand that was able to help us in being able to get uh, the suspect and be able to make this arrest. Officer Custodio Lopez with CHP Golden Gate Division says aggressive and angry driving should be avoided, but if someone is a victim of road rage, he offers a few tips. Try to avoid contact. Do not respond to any aggression with aggression. If the person, if you feel, is following you, call 911 and make sure not to drive home. Try to drive to a safe location where there's a lot of people or even to a nearby police department. A number of road rage related shootings have happened in the Bay Area over the last several months. On Tuesday morning, police found a driver's car had been shot along 580. And on February 4th, a former Cal basketball star was killed on 880. The man suspected of killing Gene Ransom was arrested a day later. Most of the recent freeway shooting cases have been difficult to solve, and freeways are expected to be busy this holiday weekend. All the more reason to be extra aware. We all have our blind spots, and it can happen to any of us. So we just ask everybody to have the patience, courtesy of letting other vehicles merge onto the freeway. And if we make a mistake, uh, just be able to say sorry. Reporting in Contra Costa County, Dan Thorne, Cron 4 News.